So my name is Pratap. Uh, I am a scientist at the Strathmore Bi University Business School in Nairobi, Kenya, and I work mainly in global health. So I studied medicine to start with uh, a long time ago in India, and then uh, decided to become a neuroscientist. So I spent about 10 years of my life as a neuroscientist, uh, and then became a health, worked as a health economist, and now find myself in Kenya studying uh, interesting problems in global health. Uh, it kind of involves a mix of health, technology, and entrepreneurship, which is really an interesting place to be. So what I study now is how do I support, how can we support uh, frontline healthcare workers in doing a better job? So sometimes it involves documentation of care. Can we give them tools and approaches to improve uh, the care that they give to every case uh, that they see? Uh, and sometimes it means giving them remote support. So harnessing a global pool of uh, skills to support these clinicians in the field about complicated cases. So they might see a case, say epilepsy, and they don't know much about it, uh, but they don't want to refer a patient 200 kilometers away. So they can get support to handle that case where, right where they are. So the questions are, how do we do this better? What kind of networks do we uh, use? What kind of tools and technology do we use to make the job of these frontline healthcare providers easier uh, and more effective? So, um, so why do research? And I see research really as uh, problem solving. So if you want to solve complex problems, you need to understand these problems a little bit more. And that's the role of research. So I, in my work, uh, try and bridge the idea of understanding the problem and trying to create solutions towards these problems. And that creative solution, uh, and that idea of trying to come up with a solution brings up all sorts of different fields. So I can, uh, we need to think about problems around entrepreneurship and commercialization and policy. We need to think about uh, human resources and what kind of uh, resources there are, what training needs to be given. And we need to think about technology, understanding what technology can do uh, and what it can't do. And these are all really interesting problems that need to be understood uh, before we can create effective solutions. So that's the real reason to do research, is that you're really trying to get more interesting and more effective solutions uh, and without doing the research, you can't come up with these solutions. So, uh, a message to everyone is that if you want to, uh, research is really exciting and it's fun uh, because you're try, uh, you're really grappling with complex problems. It's like sitting with a puzzle, a very complicated puzzle, and trying to solve it. Uh, and uh, it really is engaging a number of sides of uh, of you, uh, you as a uh, human being, a scientist. Uh, a consumer, a patient, and a doctor. So it brings in a number of different aspects that you uh, can uh, need to bring together to solve these problems. And that's the exciting thing about research. Thank you.